everyone, I'm going to be reading a book called Matilda and the Bear. And if you love my reading, uh -oh, written by written by Emma Macy, illustrated by Jitu Moni Goswami. And if you love my reading, please like, subscribe, and share. Do not forget to hit the bell icon. Let's get started. Matilda and the bear. It was a beautiful day that had turned into night. But little Matilda didn't just didn't feel right. She walked down the hall to her mom and dad and her dad she and, and told them she felt a bit a bit funny and sad. What kind of sad? What kind of funny? said dad to Matilda hugging her and her bunny. Sometimes I worry there's there a bear is under my bed and I can't get to sleep with that thought in my head. Sometimes I think that I'll fall off the swing, so I'm scared to get on for the fear that it brings. Sometimes I worry when I'm in a big crowd. I wish, and I wish I was home where it wasn't so loud. Sometimes I worry I've said something wrong. I think, and I think of it for way, way too long. Other times I get scared for nothing at all. And I get so afraid I curl up in a ball. Mom, I learned a sight word. Shh, what is that? Sight word. Oh, dear Matilda, we hear what you say. Let's practice some things to help to help fears go away. Take a big breath and count then and then count up to three. Then slowly breathe out and repeat it with me. See? Breathe in, breathe out. The yoga pose. And you can help me to turn off the camera. Mm -hmm. You can blow the page if you want, Mom. Mm -hmm. That could be an easy way. Another thing you can do is squeeze Mom, something that. tight. So she, she squashed up her bunny Mom, with all of her I might. If you're still a bit scared, when then we want to hear... When you're still, if you're still a bit scared, then we want to hear and we'll help you feel safe by knowing we're near. Mom, Each person you know have all have their own fears, but by talking about them, they soon disappear. She cuddled her parents then and hopped back into bed, no bears in her room, no fears in her head. See, she's dreaming good nights. The end. Look Bye for the message. A beautifully written story about little Matilda who can't quite understand why sometimes she feels a bit funny and sad. After a heartwarming conversation. conversation with her parents, she Matilda gets... finds com comfort with in some simple strategies to use when she's feeling anxious. Matilda's parents explain that 
Worries are very common and that by talking about these feelings, it helps them soon to soon disappear. The 